how to make an email template in canva with mailchimp hey guys welcome back in this video i'll be showing you how you can get started with building your email templates in canva so let's get into it now whenever you're using canva and you're integrating it into mailchimp a lot of people just search for email template and I'm not saying that that's a bad idea, but when you do that, there are a lot of elements that are not clickable in this. So it can be a bit difficult to convert this into a MailChimp oriented email. So I'll show you guys the proper steps in which you can build clickable items with MailChimp and Canva. So the first thing you have to do is actually you're going to start off by clicking on create in MailChimp and then you're going to click on regular email. Once you click on design email over here, you can get started with building your email and we're going to just directly go into the design email section and you can choose the classic builder or the new builder. So we're going to continue on with the newer builder and this will actually open up the templates that you can use. But we're looking to design with Canva, so I'm just going to click on start from scratch and you can get started with building your Canva templates. Now, you will be able to see the first section, which I like to delete and I like to start with my logo or my header. So usually I do like to start with a logo and you can just search on Canva for a logo and you can download any logo of your choice. So let's say if I have this logo over here, I can go on ahead and open this up. And the reason that I'm telling you guys to add these items individually, I'll explain to you guys later. But the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go on ahead and I'm going to search copy and then paste this over here and i can even you know take a look at different letters so let's say i'm searching for the letter d for durden and you know whatever your business name is you're going to add that like so and then i'm just going to take a look at the graphics over here and i'm going to use this lettering over here you can choose whichever lettering you want in canva and you're going to design or add your logo we're going to customize the color to this and i'm just going to resize it over here go back into element search for flowers like this and going to graphics and i'll just take one of these little graphic illustrations maybe like this one and i'll place one inside our logo as well like this and i'll change the color to fit the rest of our logo now i can click on share and click on download and you can enable a transparent background so you want to make sure you do that whenever you're adding your logos now once you've done that you can go into canva you can go into mailchimp and you can click on set logo over here from here you're going to add your logo image this will automatically be added to all of your sections now this is our logo the next thing you're gonna do is add the title or heading of your email which can be anything um let's say i'm launching lipsticks like this now i can click on this text and i can add a particular background to this block so i want this to be a kind of yellowish background and then i'm also going to add maybe some more padding and then i can have my basic text element you know the fonts and whatnot you can change that as well now below that you have some more you know text but i'm just going to remove that i'm also going to make the bottom padding slightly smaller now the next thing you have is you can add an image you can add a video whatever it might be but if i want to add an image that is linking to my website i can do that easily with section templates so what you're going to do is you're going to search in canva for email body templates you're not going to search for email templates you're going to search for email body templates like this so what this does is that instead of adding your item like adding your entire email template you're going to add sections and those sections can be clickable so let's say for example i go for this one or you know what whichever one let's say this one i can click on customize and whatever the information is like this and i'm going to go into here and then i'm just going to add our images or photos which whichever one it might be like this we're just going to add this and click on download over here and then what you're going to do once you download is that you're going to go into your campaign builder click on add and upload your image like this and once you've uploaded your image you're going to make sure that you are linking to it so on the bottom left you'll find your link to button and over 
over here, you're going to input the website link. So whatever is your website link, let's say this is our website, I can click on copy and then I'm going to click on paste over here. So whenever someone clicks on this image within their email box, they will actually open up this particular link. And then you can add a block background, which I'm going to add as the same background as the top section, or maybe I'm going to make it slightly later just to add a little bit of a contrast you can really choose what you want depending on the style that you're going for and then after that i can scroll down and i have a button and the button could link to the same website and then i will add my button text so i can scroll down i can customize the appearance of the buttons as well but if you scroll back you can click on the button text and you can customize that which might be shop now for us shop now and then i'm going to select the text i'm going to make it bold and i'm also going to change the font like this now below that you have your social media icons and what i'm going to do is that i'm going to go into canva and in canva i'm going to search for email social media bar or you can just search for email social media and you will be able to see you know different types of templates but you can search for email marketing templates or just email templates and within these templates i'm only going to select the social media icon so we have this type of signature template where you can add your information uh, let's say i'm going to search for email signature templates where i can link all of my socials so you guys can see there are multiple different types of templates they are they have ones with you know images so you can add your own image and you can also have direct links to your social medias if you don't want to include your image if you're you know working as a business not as an individual let's say i want to take this one over here i can remove the image as well so what i would do is that i would remove the image instead of the image you want to input your logo over here so you're going to click on upload files and then you can upload your logo then you're going to import your logo and you're going to change the color scheme accordingly as well so whatever color scheme that you want you can pick that as well let's say we're going to go for this type of color scheme I'm going to add these colors instead like this and you know obviously you can add all of your social links over here and once you add your social links you want to make sure that these are clickable links so once you insert your links over here let's say it's just like this I'm going to click on download now whenever you add those links you want to click on this and then you can always hyperlink these items simply by clicking on over here to add a hyperlink and to make sure that hyperlink is active you don't want to save this or download this as a png if you're doing hyperlinks you have to download this as a pdf however if you're fine with having to add your own custom links later on you can add this as a png so after this you can go back into your content section and you can go on ahead and go into your ad section and click on paragraphs and start adding you know your images you can click on image over here and you can add your link tree link into the image and have that open up instead once you're done with this you can click on save and exit on the top right and click on maybe later for our template editor and in this way you can build gorgeous emails with canva where the emails are easy to look at and super super interesting for your consumers for your subscribers or for your customers so i hope you guys found this video helpful if you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe.